We begin with Peter's childhood, where at a young age saw his parents slaughtered before his very eyes. When Peter was crowned Tsar, he was crowned with his brother Ivan. Action. I dub thee Tsar Ivan the Fifth. And for you, I dub thee Tsar Peter. Hooray. Peter's brother Ivan was sick and died while Peter was young. <coughs> How are you feeling today, my brother? Not very well. Ever since the sickness took hold of you, you've been unable to help me rule the country. Yeah, there's so many things that I <coughs> wanted to do by your side. Do not worry, I will carry on Russia to its glory and its greatness in your name. Now go, go to the afterlife. Throughout his reign, Peter worked on modernizing Russia. He did this by traveling to Western European countries and discovering their ideas and inventions. While Peter was away, the Strelsky planned on overthrowing Russia. I've assembled you all here because I figure that you've all been hurt by uh, Tsar Peter's rule. I figure he's been held in a tyrannic rule for way too long and something needs to be done about it. Are you all in? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah! All right, for liberty? For justice! For freedom! I don't have a sword! Once news hit Peter, he came back to Russia immediately to put an end to the chaos along with spreading his new western ideas. Russian people, we are gathered here today so that I can show you what I learned across Europe. The old ways are dead. We cannot live in the past any longer. We must modernize into the new age. <sighs> ah! Out with the old, in with the new. After debearding his men and getting the country to be more modernized, the next step was to gain naval power, and the only way to do that was to fight Sweden to gain access to the sea. Onward, men! To Sweden! Into victory! Pushed it into 
First blood. Double kill. Keep moving forward. Double kill. After successfully defeating the Swedish in battle and gaining access to the sea, Peter worked on building St. Petersburg. There! Yeah, there. there. This is where I want St. Petersburg built. St. Petersburg is almost complete. Excellent work! Once St. Petersburg was built, Peter worked on moving Russia forward towards greater naval power. Men! Russia has suffered much indignity at the hands of the other Europeans. They believe us to be inferior than them! They believe us to be uncivilized and uncouth! Well today, we prove them wrong! Today we show them all how Russia will advance! How Russia will become great! How Russia will lead the world through this! The power of our navy! Europe believes themselves to be the only great naval power! But we will show them! We will show them through the blood and the sweat of Mother Russia! That we will grow! That we will be the strongest! Now who's with me? Peter's son was found talking with an enemy and was accused of being a spy. Peter handled this himself. Don't think that I don't know what you've been doing! What? No, I didn't do anything! You've been traipsing about Europe, consorting with my enemies! I, no, I didn't! I, no! No. What do you have to say for yourself? I, I didn't do anything! I just... I didn't! Oh, you didn't do anything! Just like you've never done anything in your entire worthless life! Get him out of my sight! I don't want to see him again! In his later years, Peter had bladder problems. Even though he had surgery many times, he was not able to be saved. On his deathbed, he was writing his last words. Without a destined heir to the throne, he never finished whom to leave it to, but sent for Anna. I lived a long and full life. I built my country into an empire. I gave my people glory and dignity. My only regret is I leave this world that I was not able to give them. Bring me Anna. Get 